On the 4th of February, after having zero hours sleep, I was invited on a dating show named The Raj Chiller. The show required 10 girls to compete with each other to be my final pick. Each of them had beforehand chosen whether they were actually interested in me, a love choice, or whether they were just there for the clout of being live in front of 25,000 people, a host choice. At the end, I had to pick the one girl who stood out to me the most. If they chose love, we live happily ever after. If she chose host, then I walk away heartbroken. A lot of them haven't met you before. Uh, so why don't you introduce yourself to them? Hi. Uh, my name is Wilbur. Hi. I'm, Hi, from, Wilbur. I'm from London, Hi. England. Oh. I, 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 play a, I play a lot of Minecraft. I do a lot of music. I do a lot of YouTube. I do a lot of streaming. Uh-huh. And that's pretty, that's pretty much it. And now I'm here with you and Raj. Six <laughs> <laughs> six foot five. That's my six conversion. Six foot five. Oh, yeah. I don't I don't know what I weigh. Miss Nyachu, welcome aboard. Introduce yourself. Yes. I'm Nikki. I'm 18 years old. I live in Germany, so I'm also a fellow European. I read that your favorite movie was your name, uh, or you literally like that movie, and that's actually my favorite movie. So maybe we could do that as a first date. We could watch that. But an e girl, I would say, is almost an enigma. I don't think I could accurately no. describe an e girl. I guess. I guess it's short for electronic girl, but that sounds like a sex doll, so I'm not talking about those. I think that is Joe from you right now. I mean, now. Wilbur, you said you like kindness, and I've heard from so many people here that I'm very kind. So... Okay. Good. I, li I, like a, I like She a, said yeah. I hope yeah, I I, she wished death upon me. She said I hope I die from my FMFC. <laughs> I've got a question for the ladies here. Uh, Wilbur just made a video about being a simp. Okay, he made. I saw it. Yes, he made a video about being a simp. Where I think Wilbur, you extensively described your time you, you, that you are a simp. Is that correct, or how to be a simp? Could you maybe describe I, it? I want to be one. Why do you want to be a I simp? Okay, well, no, yeah, why do you want to be a simp, Wilbur? I know you call it fourth base, right? But for me, fourth base is speaking to the girl, right? They get to so fourth, fourth base fourth every base time. All of us. Yeah. But if we talk, if we're talking is... about Sims, are we still talking about the people who are just nice to girls because they want sex? Because I don't well, that, know. that's all men, though. Isn't that's all, isn't that's that a nice because guy? Because I think Sims are it's really all unattractive. No man has sense. wanted the sex with me. What? Okay, sorry. What? There's Why'd no you girl out there that? that's gonna. Would you cheer Wilbur up on a daily basis if he was sad? So. Um, the first thing I would do is I would ask him what he needs. Like, uh, sometimes you do need your time off for yourself, or you need to talk, or you need distraction, and I would ask him what he needs, because for me, uh, communication is really important. Um, and then if he needs his space, I will definitely give him a space, but if he needs someone, I will always be there. And I also give some really good hugs. So if you need a hug, I'm always in for a hug. All right, he's already had he's had enough hugs. Okay, he wants more than hugs. Yeah. But like, I I like very dark. I also like the, the the hugs and the gentle kindness of Nietzsche. Yeah. Wow. All all three of those are my favorites. Wow. If Wilbur is at an event and he you are with him and he is getting hit on, I'm talking aggressively by another woman, and just with no regard to your relationship with him. How are you going to react in that particular situation? We we were all at a point where we were like really fangirl and growling someone and if we got to meet that person we would probably or maybe try to shoot that shot and I would be like, okay, you know, I get it, it's uh -huh. okay. What would your ideal E date look like? What would it look like? Let's start with uh let's start with Nayachu. Go ahead. Since you play Minecraft, I also play Minecraft. Um, I really like build battle, and I really like doing build battle together. Ladies, mm -hmm. of all the people here, who do you think is the worst choice and why for Mr. Wilbur? Uh, Nayachu, you, you must be honest with Wilbur here and say who you think is the worst choice. Um, I really don't like that question. Can I say, can I say that? Um, oh. I... I have to go with with Candyland, I think. Oh no, really? really Nia, you, do you know how? I wait, that hurts so much. You're, you're really hurting me really, now. I'm really sorry, and I do understand you with the language barrier and everything. But um, I think you're a little too suggestive. Is that the word? Like, <gasps> like no, like sex, like you know, you talk about. She's sex too sexual. And, yeah, like I don't oh, know. Wow. I can't I believe so Nietzsche you called me a slut. She called bro, me a slut, bro. I mean. oh my God, I mean. I'm so sorry. I can't believe it. I'm Candy, so you're not a slut. Just out of curiosity, are you, uh, are you 
How do you tell time on that fucking clock behind you? I've been wondering this the whole show. <laughs> it's blank. What time is it, Wilbur? I can't even tell. Do you want to do you want me to scream at it, Raj? Yeah, what, it, do you want to see what happens when I scream at it? Yeah, scream at it. Ah, uh, what? Candyland and Nayachu, obviously you guys had an intense exchange beforehand. Candyland, have you forgiven her for what she said? Please I'm not sure me. I please. Well, I'm not sure I can ever forgive something I like that. I've never heard those. Things. Like those words were so hard. Mm. It was really hurtful. I feel like I need to better my personality after I feel like I do like maybe no, change. No, you don't need to change. Yeah, don't. don't change because I said something. Only I change your clothing, you slow, as she said. One of you is going to get eliminated, and that person is, regretfully, the person that will not come back is Candyland. I'm sorry. It's the end of the road. You have been eliminated by Wilbur. Nayachu, you are safe. Congratulations. Candyland chose when it had the, when she had the option between lover host she chose host. Wow. Oh. Wait, what? Candy, you chose host. <laughs> I did. Who can even be trusted anymore? Bye. Give it up Bye, for Candyland. Candy. Thank you. Bye, Candy. Let's give it up for your top oh, three. Fun. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's Minx. It's Baffy. And it's Nyachu. Question that I have, ladies, is. Wilbur, let's say his career tanks, money's not coming in anymore, and he has to make an OnlyFans to survive. <laughs> Would you support this move and be part of his content? I would be his number one supporter. Really? Okay. Yeah. What about if I instead, in my in my high and mighty position, decide to change career? What would be the perfect career for me to change to? In your Musician. opinion. Musician. Become a musician. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Bottom two, Nayachu and Baffy. Mm. Wilbur, you look absolutely, you can't even look at the camera right now. <laughs> it was so easy getting rid of the, the, the ones who were trying to one-up each other. And now we're down to three genuine interesting personalities and i don't i it's hard it's I difficult know. it's very difficult i get it let me let me spin my fidget spinner a little bit oh god you're so cool <laughs> the person getting eliminated from the show and not moving through to the finals nyachu baffy baffy nyachu the person getting eliminated from the show is Miss Buffy, I'm sorry, the end of the road has come for you! <laughs> she has chosen before the show. She chose host! Oh my gosh, Buffy! <laughs> you chose what? host! Oh <laughs> my <laughs> goodness! Yes, you! Another time, Willington. It's been a pleasure, my friend. It's been a pleasure. Turn around. I'm going to describe what's going to happen. Both of you are going to get an opportunity to have a one on one date with Wilbur Suit. Who would like to go first? Hello. Uh, hello. I follow? promise you, yeah. I'm not <laughs> Sam. I swear. Like, okay. okay. Um, I don't want to out myself. I only watched your stream once. I watched your YouTube videos, and I followed you a few weeks back. But I don't know too much about you, and I'm not That's like. That's fine obsessively trying to find out stuff about you i mean now i would love to get to know you but um i got on this show because i wanted to do something spontaneous and um yeah oh this is is gonna be a very hard choice yeah i understand <laughs> no one told me i was gonna be walking away from this this whole thing sadder than i came in <laughs> This is very hard. I don't want you to be sad. No, don't worry. No, you're not the one making me sad. Don't worry. Nothing is neither of you. <laughs> oh, what's your. Is that a Poro on your left? Oh, yeah. It's a Poro. Wait. It's a sad Poro. It's a, why is he sad? Um. Sometimes you gotta feel sad, you know? Sometimes you gotta cry. It's, you know, I'm just. He's here. I'm giving him emotional support. I'm letting him sit here because he's sad and it's okay. Sometimes you do have to cry, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, yeah, I agree. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. Whatever it's happens. Nice talking to you. Yes, whatever yes. happens, happens. I was expecting I, I was expecting a lot more aggressive 
people on this show, and I'm happy that I managed to whittle it down to some genuinely kind people, and oh. you're no exception. Well, mm -hmm. Wilbur, it is now time yeah. to make your decision. How do you think you guys did? Um, I think I need therapy after that date, Raj. <laughs> you think you need therapy? Yeah. I'll be 100% real with you. I think I did well. Like, um, I... We, we have something in common, and that's nice. We found something we have in common. Minx, I think you are such a great and creative person, and you can, can come up with so much stuff. So I think that he would choose- Why is the competition being sold? I can't believe you, Nikki. <laughs> I'm, I don't know. I've, <laughs> I've never, wanna... I've never not wanted to be a, a cunt to someone before. <laughs> what is this? I don't I like her. Uh, she scares me. You found me. your She's... kryptonite, Mink. <laughs> yeah, I found my kryptonite. She's too sweet. I've tried. And even if this is a competition, I'm not gonna scare away from saying nice things to you because I really think those things. Dude, this is fucking Jesus Christ reincarnated, right? <laughs> I don't believe this bitch ain't got a bad bone in her body. I don't know what to say to you, Nikki. I'm nothing. You put me in a halt. You put me on a standstill. I'm sorry. I apologize. No, don't apologize for that. You're making it worse. <laughs> I want. I just want to hug you. That's what I want to do right now. I want to hug you too. Oh God. I want to hug you too. You're not. Nope. You need to stop talking. You're the bitch I'm supposed to be curb stomping. I don't want to curb stomp you. I don't want to smash your head against the curb. I just want to hug you. That's very like, sweet. Sorry, that was the most intense waiting period in the history of the Raj Chiller. Wilbur, you went back and Hello. forth. How are you feeling? Yeah. Emotionally exhausted. Awful. Uh, very uncomfortable. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> the winner of the Raj Chiller featuring Wilbur is... Here's what happened to the best of my description. After a 15 minute wait period, which is the longest the Raj Shiller has ever had, I finally made my choice. Between shouty Irish woman Minx and the most sickeningly hu human being the world has ever seen, I chose Nikki. Nikki won the Raj Shiller. However, we now needed to find out what Minx had chosen beforehand. She chose host, which made me waggle my finger angrily at the camera. Look at me go. Urgh. Uh, she, she confesses that she started off not caring about this at all, but as the night went on, she discovered that we said the same sense of humour and things, and so she tried to change her choice to love, but the producers wouldn't let her. They were too strict. So now we had to find out what Nikki had chosen, love or host. And it turns out she'd picked love as well, and we ended up winning the show. Which was brilliant. I then shut off my webcam and rolled into bed, and I slept for a week! I slept for an entire week.